Hello everyone. Today I'm going to give you a mini lecture on um, the elements of a plot and provide a diagram for you to follow along. So here's our diagram. You can see that we um, have this little guy and this is just kind of a cute little graphic here. He's going up through the rising action. He gets to the climax, to the following, to the falling action, and finally to the conclusion. And then he moves to the next story. <laughs> so the plot is designed or is defined as the organized pattern or sequence of events that make up every story. Every plot is made up of a series of incidents that are related to one another. And this is going to be uh, really important for you to pay attention to the plot in the short stories that you're going to be reading this week. The first part, or the beginning, number one, the first point in our journey along the plot graph, is um, exposition. And exposition is um, the beginning of the story where the characters are introduced. You might get descriptions about them. We learn about the setting of the story. And we're introduced to the conflict or the problem in the story. And again, you can see he's, he's getting to the next point. And his next point is rising action. Um, this is the part of the story where um, uh, conflicts begin to develop. Um, it's building interest or suspense occurs. And, and this is when you start um, finding out some of the details that um, have caused or created the problem. Alrighty, and next we move on to the climax. The climax is the turning point. This is when kind of everything comes together. And usually the main characters come face to face with the conflict. They might confront one another, um, but they come to some kind of issue that they've got to make some decisions and um, change the course of action or in some way impact the course of action. And from there, we go to the falling action. So we're up here at the apex, so we're at um, the climax, and the falling action is where all the pieces start to get together, and the problem begins to, you can begin to see how the problem or the climax is going to be resolved, the conflict is going to be resolved. So here we go, and next we come to a resolution. This is the last piece of the plot and the resolution is when the story comes to a conclusion it comes to an end and sometimes um, in the short stories that we'll read the ending will be nice and neat and everybody lives happily ever after but mostly in the short stories that we read they don't they kind of end on a certain uh, sometimes the endings can be ambiguous they're up to interpretation sometimes they can be rather depressing or sad. Um, it's pretty rare that we get that happily ever after that we got in childhood when we're reading short fiction, but we'll see what we can find in the selections that you guys have created. So that's it for plot. Let me know if you have any questions.